In this tutorial, we're going to be discussing functions that are built into Python. To begin with, we're going to discuss how to convert a string into an integer and an integer into a string. To begin with, I'm going to create a variable called myString. I'm going to set this to 100. Now I'm going to try and print this off, but also try and times this by 2. Now just to mention, print is also a built-in function. So I'm going to print this and I'm going to times this by two just to kind of see what happens. When I play this, what I'm getting is I'm getting 100 and I'm getting another 100, which is actually 100 times two in the string version. If I do it by three and press play, I'd expect it to happen three times. So I'm getting 100 and 100 and 100. Just to kind of show you this, I'm going to put a little space in there. and I'm going to press play again just to show you what's actually happening. So I'm getting that 100 in a space, 100 in a space, 100 in a space. I'm going to remove that space, but now I actually what I would like it to do is actually give me the output 300. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a variable. I'm going to just call it number. And I'm going to say int, which is our function, open and close my brackets or my parentheses. And I'm going to put in this variable name, my string. Now I'm going to grab number and I'm going to put that there into my print statement. And this time when I press play, what it's actually doing is it's actually doing the maths that I want. So it's timesing the number, which was 100 by three. Now I would like to do the opposite. So I'm going to create a variable called number and I'm going to equal this to 100 but this time I will create it as an integer. Now if I wanted to change this into a string all I would do is create a variable called string or my string And I'm going to create a function or use the function called str, open my brackets, and this time putting in the value or an integer into the str function. And what that would do is it would convert the integer into a string. And it is as simple as that. So two functions, the first one is int, and the second one is str, which is short for string. The integer requires you to put a string and the string requires you to place in an integer and it would change the string into an integer or an integer into a string. Hope you've enjoyed the tutorial.